Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In this video, I will draw this figure in AutoCAD. Let's start. First, I will draw these two circles. The diameter of this circle is given, which is 5.6 mm, and the diameter of this circle is given, which is 2.8 mm radius. This two is written because this diameter is also applies to this circle, and this diameter is also applies to this circle. Let's draw it. So first, click on circle arrow, then click on center diameter, then make a circle of 2.8 mm diameter. Then again click on circle arrow, center diameter and make a circle of 5.6 mm diameter. Now I will create this portion, this portion. So all the dimensions are given, this distance is given which is to the center line which is 6 mm, given over here. And this distance is also given which is 8 mm. So let's draw this line. So first click on line, then from the center of these two circles make a line of 6 mm and then a downward line of 8 mm then this la this distance is also given which is 3.5 mm now enter 3.5 mm distance horizontally now we will make this line the dimension of this line is not given and it is not required because we will make a line of any length then the extra portion should be trimmed so make a line of any length straight vertically then escape then erase these two lines and this radius is given first I will erase to see clearly this radius is given over here which is radius of 2 because the object is symmetrical so this radius is given over here so let's make it right click on circle arrow then click on 10 10 radius then click on this circle and click on this line and enter a radius of 2 mm now enter TR from the keyboard and press double enter now select this line and this portion and escape now I will make this rectangle the center rectangle so the dimension of this rectangle is given this distance is 2 mm from this distance we will start our rectangle so first I will erase these lines So this distance is 2 mm and if we see the fig if we see the figure so from this line this distance is 3.5 to the center of the rectangle so this distance is also 3.5 because this is the center line of the rectangle so it the total distance becomes 7 mm 7 mm and this distance is 3 so this distance becomes 1.5 if you divide 3 by 2 so it becomes 1.5 mm so this distance is 1.5 mm this distance so let's draw it First click on line, then click on the end point of this line and make a line of 2 mm distance upward and then a horizontal line of 1.5 mm, enter, then make a line of 7 mm vertically, and then make a horizontal line of 3 mm horizontally and then again enter a distance of 7 mm downward and then escape. First I will erase these two lines, so I erase it, then L for line, enter from the keyboard and in, click on in point and click on this in point so the rectangle is created now this radius is given this fillet radius is given which is radius of 1 and the 4 4 is written because this radius is applies to all the 4 corners of the rectangle and this fillet radius is also given over here which is radius of 1 so all the, all the fillet radius is same now F press from the keyboard enter and then click on the right side of the, of the mouse click on radius and enter radius of 1 mm now click on this line and this line space to repeat the command click on this line and this line space click on this line and this line now click space click on this line and this line again space click on this line and this line now if we see the figure the figure is symmetrical from this center line this center line so we will, so we will mirror this side so the right side will created automatically Let's mirror it. First select all the object, then enter MI, press MI from the keyboard, then enter and then click on the midpoint of this line and click on the midpoint of this line. Click on now so this side is created easily. Now we will make this portion. I will erase. Now we will draw this arc. So click on circle arrow, then click again on 1010 radius, click on this circle, 
now click on this circle but the outside of the circle now enter radius of 12 mm now t r enter from the keyboard double enter and trim this portion so this figure is created easily and according to this dimension here you may face a problem for example if you click wrongly let's remove this part and if you click on 10 pin radius and click on the inner side of the circle and on this inner side of the circle and enter a radius of 12 mm then you may face this problem because this time this portion is created wrong 